There's a dart of a pass. And off to the races. There goes Brown. Joffrey Brown all by himself. He is into the end zone. Wes Bryant here with Ross Martin from Inside Carolina talking about the Tar Heels who have monumental expectations this season. Ross, what have you seen from this program? Are they ready for the bright lights and those high national rankings? Yeah, I think in year three, uh, they're a little bit ahead of schedule, but I think with Sam Howe at the helm and improved defense and all all five offensive linemen back, I think this team um, is not only experienced and has the leadership and is ready to take the next step, but has the, the you know, they've had some tough losses. They've had some some big wins that put it all together. I think this team um, is kind of is, is ready to be where they are, a top 10 team and ready to compete and take the next step in the big games. What does the team think internally about those expectations? How have they been handling those? How has Mac been helping them to be able to handle those? They have great senior leaders. I mean, Jeremiah Gimmel, an inside linebacker, is a huge team leader. I've uh, been there for four seasons. Sam Howe is a great team leader. You have very poised, um, respected guys that are leading both the offense and defense. I think it really helps to kind of set the standard. And, and Mac Brown's been there. You know, he's won big games. He's played big games. I think he, he kind of knows how to, you know, kind of lean on the coaches and even teach the coaches how to handle these expectations. Third and four, big play. He's trying to take off again, but that hole closes up on him and down he goes. The difference in this team compared to last year is going to be on defense. I think it's going to be a much better improved defense that's really going to keep them in the games. Last year, they only really rolled out two or three, maybe four guys they really trusted on defensive line. This year, we will play six, seven, eight guys, big guys up front in that 3-4 defense. You're talking about Ray Bohasek. Miles Murphy should have a big season as a sophomore. Tamari Fox um, and some names, some new names like Christian Barner, um, KJ Hester played some last year. They have the bodies to do what they want to do on that three, four front in Jay Bateman's defense. That's me huge. How under center, toss sweep, reverse. Grows, flip it into the quarterback. Trickery and Mac Brown pouring it on. What do the fans want to see from this Carolina program this season? It's time to win the big game. It's time to, to get to 10-11 wins. They've played around with it. They got uh, eight last year and lost the bowl game. They lost unfortunate games to Virginia and Florida State. You've got to eliminate those kind of losses where you're favored. I think UNC should be favored in, in every game but Notre Dame and maybe Miami. That will be interesting to see the spread there. But they've got to win the games they're supposed to win and then go into places like Notre Dame, Miami at home, big contests and get those wins and uh and that will help them get to a, the place they want to be which is in charlotte for the acc championship game 